came back. Want to take the job? You pay, I work. What's the job? Ah, a fellow businessman. I'm Vincent, but you can call me Vince. First task is to find the ship's log for the Pride. Charles Reed. A few questions, if I may. Sure, sure. Why are you looking for a ship log? Maybe I'll tell you when the job is done. Right now, you don't need to know. In my line of work, you don't get far without appreciating the need for privacy. I understand. What can you tell me about the Pride? I'm gonna need somewhere to start. Mostly rumors. The captain was an exemplary patriot. Always had a flag with him. His last shipment may have been chemicals and metal barrels. It could be resting on the seabed a thousand miles away. What makes you think it can be found? I wouldn't waste my money on you unless I had hope. Local drunkards say they saw the barge on the sunken road near the fish market. Good. I'll check the place and bring you the Pride's ship log if it's still there. See you later. Get off my ship, you newcomer rat! I wonder what happened to the chemicals. Get off my ship, you newcomer rat! the ship log of the Pride, safe and sound. Let me see. Yes. Yes. The last page is exactly what I need. Good job, Reed. I expect the pay to be just as good. Sure, sure. Take this. But I have two more tasks for a man as capable as you are. Find more ships. I wouldn't pass up the extra dollars or bullets. These next ones won't be so easy. But you showed yourself a capable and trustworthy man. So prepare your guns. It might get hot. I've bought two more ships, Red Queen and Skylark. Both are troublesome. The Red Queen. Sounds nice. What happened to Her Majesty? You won't say that when you see it. It crashed near the asylum and, uh, something happened to it. it made me shiver, even when I saw it from afar. Well, where do you think the Skylark flies? I only have a guess. You see, it was no ordinary ship. Cargo on it? Well, it was under prohibition, if you know what I mean. You think the smugglers got it? I saw a box with the ship's name. Some hobo was burning it for warmth. For a bullet, he told me he found it near the old Wharf Street Harbor. I'll get started, Vince. Soon the logs will be yours. I'll be waiting here. We newcomers should stick together around these parts.
someone unloaded the Skylark's cargo. And maybe they took the log as well. Here's the ship log from the Red Queen. I'd suggest it's best not to read it. That bad? Well, I only need the last page. Is it intact? Yep, all the pages are there. Great. Here's the reward I promised, Mr. Reed. Here's the log from the Skylark. The men who unloaded it were not happy to see me. Unloaded? You mean the cargo survived the storm? There were crates. And armed men on guard. Looked like a local gang. I dealt with them, but it's not worth trying to claim your property. But all that cargo, a small fortune. Uh, perhaps you're right. It's better to be poor than dead. A wise decision. Now that you have all the ship's logs at your disposal, perhaps you can explain the reason. Why did you collect them? I suppose I, you've earned my trust. While drinking at the local tavern, I concocted a brilliant business plan. Well, we all know the booze only produces great ideas. What's the plan? I spent some bullets buying several lost ships from their owners. The dates in our treaties were slightly wrong. And who here could verify? And now it sounds like you're wasting good beer money. Wrong, friend. With these logs, I'll receive a handsome sum in insurance when I return to Boston. The companies will have no reason to refuse. Not a bad insurance racket, Vince. A man like you could go far. I always keep an eye out for opportunities. Meet me in Boston and the first round's on me. Good luck, friend. See you later. <laughs> 